up with our motto that learning be a joy and teaching a pleasure. Here we are with the remote teaching and learning process to bridge the gap. Happy learning, students. Standard 6, Mathematics. Chapter 1, Basic Concepts in Geometry. First point. A point is shown by a tiny dot. Capital letters of the alphabet are used to name a point. The points P and G are shown in the figure alongside. Second, lines. When we say line, we mean straight line. The line does not have any points showing its limits. Line does not have any end points. Third, line segment. A line segment has two points showing its limits. They are called end points. We write line segment AB as seg AB. Ray. A ray is a part of a line. The starting point of a ray is called its origin. Here, P is the origin. An arrowhead shows that the ray is infinite in the direction of Q. The figure can be read as ray PQ. The ray PQ is not read as ray QP. Plane. In mathematics, a flat surface is called a plane. The name of the plane in the picture is H. Concurrent lines. When two or more lines pass through the same point, they are called Concurrent lines. In the figure shown beside, all the lines are concurrent lines because they are passing through the same point. Now, what this point is called? This point is called point of concurrence. The common point through which the lines passes is called their point of concurrence. So, in this figure, point P is the point of concurrence. Collinear points. Three or more points which lie on a single straight line are said to be collinear points. In the figure shown below, line L is having point P, point Q and point R as collinear points. Non-collinear points. Points which do not lie on the same line are called non-collinear points. In the figure shown below, point A, point B, point C and point D are non-collinear points. Parallel lines. Lines which lie in the same plane but do not intersect are said to be parallel to each other. In the figure given below, line M and line N are parallel to each other. Even if we extend the lines, they will do not intersect each other. Such lines are said to be parallel lines. In the next figure, what you can see? Yes, seg AB is parallel to seg CD. Next, intersecting lines. Lines which lie in the same plane but 
intersect each other are said to be intersecting lines. In the figure given below, line LK and line GH are intersecting at point P. Point P is their point of intersection. An infinite number of lines can be drawn through one point. One and only one line can be drawn from two distinct points. Practice set one. Question one. Look at the figure alongside and name the following. First, collinear points. Point M, point O, point T. Point R, point O, point N. Second, rays. Ray O P, Ray O N, Ray O T, Ray O S, Ray O R, and ray om line segment seg rn seg mt seg op seg on seg ot seg os seg or and seg om fourth lines line mt line rn question 2 Write the different names of the line. Answer. Line L, Line AB, Line AC, Line AD, Line BC, Line BD, Line CD. Question 3. Match the following. Answer. First, it is a line. Second, it is a line segment. Third, it's a plane. Fourth, it is a ray. Question 4. Observe the figure below. Name the parallel lines, the concurrent lines and the points. Answer. First, parallel lines. Line B, line M, line Q. Line A, line P. Second, concurrent lines. Line A, line B, line C, line AC. Line P, line Q, line AD. Third, point of concurrence, point A, point D. Thank you.